Praise the Lord. Amen. 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 We're so glad. Amen. Thank the Lord. Amen. We hope to see some of you all this afternoon. If not all of y'all. Amen. At the five o'clock service. Amen. At, amen. Brother Weeks. Amen. Amen. If you enjoy this occasion, amen. I believe you'll be glad that you were there. Amen. And 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 you know you you you, you reap what you sow. Amen. And, and, and when you sow it with a good attitude, when you sow it cheerfully, when you sow it because that's where you believe and know that you should be. Hello, somebody. See a child of God ought to be in God's house, y'all. Hello, somebody. Amen. That's when they break the bread. That's when. That's when they pass out the blessings, amen? And you want to come with the right attitude because you don't want daddy to see no kind of funny look on you, amen? And miss no piece of bread. Hello, somebody. I thank the Lord, amen? It's God that gives the increase, amen? Can I get a little bite? It, 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 it's God that gives the increase, amen? I thank the Lord. We also thank you for your, your, for your giving, amen? For being a blessing, amen? That's what it's all about, amen? I thank the Lord. Some people say, well, you know, uh, tithes and offering, that's not in the New Testament. That you can never a lie. Huh? Don't you ever let anybody convince you that foolish behind me. Say, amen? Mm -hmm. See, let me show you something. In order to know about tithes and offering or anything in the Bible, all you got to do is pick up the Bible and read the first chapter again and see. Mm -hmm. Amen? This is a this is a seed ministry. Your tithes and offerings are seeds. Hello, somebody. Amen. If you're not planting any seeds, then you're not getting in the harvest. Amen. Hello, somebody. Amen. That's just what time it is. Now, Jesus said, all that ever came before me are thieves and robbers. Amen. God established this thing in six days. Hello, somebody. Amen. And the whole everything cross pollinate from those six days. Amen. So when they put their tithes and their offering in, it becomes a form of seed. Hello, somebody. Amen. And you get the increase. Amen. So in it, you, 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 hello, somebody, whatever you sow, that's what you reap. If you seek yourself in there, you get yourself. Amen. Increase in yourself. Amen. If, if you sow your tithes and offering, and if you sow them with a chip of heart, hello, somebody. Amen. Huh? You ever, you ever hit the concept of, of, of sowing something with a cheerful heart? I'm not just talking about sowing it, but sowing with a cheerful heart. Amen. Amen. You, 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 know, you know, if you're a person that like black eyed peas, uh -huh. uh, hello somebody, no, no, there's some of y'all in here. I can feel it, I can feel it. If you're a person that like them lima beans, uh -huh. oh, y'all don't want to talk. I know that I hit the head on the head, amen. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. If, you, if you're a person that like them lima beans, hello somebody, amen. If you sow lime and bean, see, see, let me show you something. When you, when you hit the nail on the head, they put a smile on the face and they can't help themselves laugh. But amen. But that's how it be when you sow something with a cheerful heart. When you get the increase from what you sow, you be laughing. Amen. You be full of joy. Amen. See, see, because when you sowing what you like to sow, if you, if you eat black, if you don't eat black eyed peas, you're a sow. But you'll sow them to sell and just keep a few up. If you like lima beans, you're going to sow the lima beans and you're going to sow them with a smile, with an anticipation of uh, what it's going to bring forward. Amen? You're going to sow that with a cheerful heart. Amen? Because you want to reap that. Y'all don't want to talk to me. Hell, somebody. Amen? So when you sow that, amen, with a cheerful heart, it's going to come back to you and make you very happy. You're going to be excited. Amen? So when you sow with a cheerful heart, amen, then when it come back, it's going to make you very happy, amen. I thank the Lord. See, if one thing about y'all don't want to talk to me, let me leave that alone. I see some, I see some hate, but I, it's called the haters hate. I'm on. Huh? Can, can we shoot past the haters? Can, can we shoot past the haters? What's that usher back there? I need that bike door to stay closed for the after stay in here. Who's for the usher? Amen. Amen. See, 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 when, when we when we sow, amen. When you sow cheerfully, hello somebody. You 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 reap cheerfully, amen. You want hey, 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 hey. Amen. Hey, hey. 
That's right. <laughs> thank the Lord. Amen. Amen. I thank the Lord. Bind up every devil, every wicked, and every satanic demon. Hello, somebody. Amen. Uh, praise be to God. Can't nobody sit still for that demon. Uh, hush your mouth right now. In Jesus' name. Hello, somebody. Amen. I thank the Lord. I give God the praise, the glory. Now, now you're not coming up with that craziness in it, huh? Baby, that wasn't wrong with all that blame pit and all kind of mess. Well, you scream all the time. Mm, praise the Lord, amen. amen. Huh? We we you so we you so cheerful, amen. And, and, and you you reap cheerful, amen. amen. God, hello somebody, amen. But what you have to realize, oh y'all don't want to talk to me. When you sow in the God, <laughs> everything cross pollinate. Paul tried to tell you about sowing. He said, when you sow in the God, he said, uh, 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 it's not a pollen, it's not Paul. It's not the man of God, it's not the men of God, it's not the it's not the church. It's God to give the increase. Amen. And when you sow cheerfully in the God, when God get an increase, you're going to reap cheerfully because God, y'all don't want to talk to me. He's going to bless it. The increase is coming from God. It's not coming from me. It's coming from God. Amen. And you sowing cheerfully because you understand that you sowing in the God. Hello, somebody. See, see anybody? See, y'all don't want to talk to me. Can, can I go over? I can't stay still now. See, see, well, let me understand. Let me, let me get this. Let me get you down. You, see, you talking about the blessings of Abraham. And some of y'all is living in poverty because you missed the blessings of Abraham. Because you don't understand a dollar bill or its contents. Amen. The Bible said it's no I mean the, the Bible the, the dollar said it's no good for all debt, public, and private. That's all it is, amen. But now but 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 Abraham, the blessing in order to get the blessing of Abraham, in order to real y'all don't want to talk to me. Abraham had tapped into something, and the flow started. Y'all don't want to talk to me. Can't, can't, can't. Is there anybody? I mean, I ought to save it for later. But the idea might be gone later. See, Abraham sold in the Melchizedek. A Melchizedek, however you want to. No, y'all. Whatever part of where you from, Alabama, Georgia. Tampa, uh, hello somebody, amen? Yes. Are you from a, uh, are you a Jew? Abraham sold in the Melchizedek, amen? amen. Now, 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 he was the king of Salome. Huh? Jesus is the prince of Salome. Melchizedek was the king, y'all don't want to talk to me. In other words, he sold in to, to greater. He sold into the greater. He didn't sow into the man. He sold into the spirit. Yes, sir. Hello, somebody. That's why a lot of people say, oh, you ain't got to pay your tithes and all this stuff. Because they they looking at from the cardinal perspective. They're not looking from the spiritual perspective. They swear that they're spiritual, but they're, 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 they're a little bit they're, they're handicapped. Hello, somebody. And that's a spirit of error. Amen. See, see, when you stole in the bell, bell today, hello somebody, you see when you bring your tithes and offering in, see Abraham sold in the Melchizedek. And when he sold, he got that hello somebody. And even in the famine, he was made rich. Amen. And his son was made rich in the second family. Hello, somebody. Because they had tapped into something. If they had tapped into something, Melchizedek had directed their footsteps. They began to dig wells and find water. Y'all don't want to talk to me. In the water, they were dealing with paying the gift to increase. Hello, somebody. Amen. They were tapping into wells because wells, because the water fed the cattle. Jesus said on, on, on the well, Hello, somebody, amen. A well on top of a well. And the woman said, our father Jacob 
game, but y'all don't want to talk to me. And his cattle drunk from, he said, his water is necessary. <laughs> huh? Jesus said, I got some water to give you that you will never. He said, when you so off into me, uh, he said, when you give unto me, he said, you've been giving unto the church. You've been giving unto man. But you hadn't been so, y'all don't want to talk to me. Uh, Mm. You you just sowing, you 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 putting your seeds by the wayside. You just throwing seeds, hey amen. But the, the only way you can sow cheerfully is to know in your heart that you sowing in the Christ. Ooh, what do you say? And see, you have to let go when you see when you let go, you don't think about what you did. Y'all don't want to talk to me. You forget about all that. When you fall it off, of, when you fall it off of a high mountain, and you don't let the limb go, it's time to stop thinking about regretting that you let it go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's time to start looking for your help now. Amen. Amen. You know somebody, amen. amen. It, it, it's time to transform your mind into the, that of a bird. That's right. So eagle or something, go a little higher, you know. Yes, 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 mess with y'all a little bit, amen. amen. Uh, so don't let nobody hook you up in that silliness now. And miss your blessing, amen. amen. Huh? The, 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 the whole, all you need to know is that in order to understand anything by God, you've got to go back to the beginning. And you've got to go back to the book of Genesis and see God created this thing in six days. There's no coincidence. That Jesus was dead and buried and rose on the third day because that's the day of seeds and the increase. <laughs> Look upon the field. They already ready for a hello somebody. Huh? That's the day of increase. Hello somebody. So you want to make sure that you're getting your increase. Hello somebody. Amen. And you have to know how to sow to get your increase. Amen. You have to be sowing with a cheerful heart. Amen. You have to be, and the only way you can show with a chip heart, the Bible said, get, get wisdom, but with all you're getting, get. You know somebody, amen? If you ain't got no understanding, you don't know what you're doing, no how. They sowing through understanding. They putting it right there. It ain't like the, it ain't like the, the, the increase going to be 200 fold. He said, he said 30, 60, 100. A hundred is the fool. Come on, come on. Tell somebody, hey, man. And you sowing, you sowing for the wrong reason. Your Bible said we are led of the Spirit. Tell somebody, hey, man. So being led, tell somebody. So when I give, I'm giving. I, I, I you know, my, my mother raised us. And, and, and we always, we were little children going to church, but we always had a nickel, a dime, a quarter. Mama and them wouldn't go send us without a, a, a something to put in church. Tell right, right. somebody, we always had something to put in church. Because we were sowing, they understood she was raising us to be sowing. Tell somebody, we always had a little piece of bread to get off in there, amen? Because Mama wanted the full increase. Mama know who put bread on the table, clothes on the back. Shoes on the feet, huh? Roof over the head. You know somebody, amen. Abraham himself gave the Melchizedek the tithes, and the Bible says why his the wife's children was still in his loins. What you think they talking about? He was already, and if you will inherit the blessings of Abraham, it's going to be a spiritual blessing, and it's going to be by promise. You know, and you have to receive it by faith, but you have to give your, your giving is going to have to be by faith. Huh? See, me and me and the you, so you ain't got to put no money in no church. You ain't got to get no man. But he, he, what he really said is you don't have to. It, it, I can tell you that as long as you don't understand, you're giving it to Christ. Right, right, right. As long as, I, as, long as you don't understand what it's all about. As long as you deal with that. How many of y'all know Jesus was the first miracle Jesus did was turn the water into wine? Am I right about it? Am I right about it? Do you know why? 
Because he put a block of a fence or stuff. Uh. Huh? Because he can hear cornerstone. Huh? Now you either got one thing about it, you can hear that drink that water and get sick in the belly. But if you start drinking that wine, you either gonna get full of the spirit or drunk. Amen. 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 Hello, somebody. Amen. Amen. You need to be drunk with the wine or full of the spirit. Somebody gonna get it by power, but somebody gonna get it straight. You know somebody, I'm just saying, hey man, everybody don't know how to drink wine. Some people ain't gonna leave it to, hello somebody. No, I thank the Lord, I'm talking about the good wine. I'm talking about, I'm talking about spirit now. Hello somebody, hey man, you done been riding with the stack. No, you not, the Bible said that Abraham staggered not. What you want y'all to leave me alone? Uh, uh, I'm just saying. Huh? Is that not what it said? I'm just saying, amen. Is that not what it said? Huh? He staggered not in this belief. Hello, somebody. By faith. God tell me to do something. It's a done need. Amen. God tell me to give some God. He put on my heart with my with my building farm. If that's the last, I got that, huh? Don't you know I got sister? See, what you don't understand is the principle of a thing. Do you know a wine old will always get some wine? A wine old will never be denied his wine. Where you at now? You all right? You sitting in the building crazy? What you mean? I don't need for the quarter to get a bottle. <laughs> we can chip now. <laughs> we wine away and go hell on somebody. Your pride, your arrogance may stop you from getting full of the spirit. But he gonna get a drink. Y'all don't wanna talk to me. Huh? I'm gonna have something to put in there. Amen. But if I gotta if I gotta get somebody to chip with me. Huh? I got to believe God. He said he'll provide my needs according if if, if, if if what I put in there becomes my need, then it's up to God to provide. Y'all don't want to talk to me. See, you trying to set a goal. You trying to give this here and give that that and not, not make it a need. You just trying to do something. You just drunk. Huh? Tell somebody, hey, amen. And you're not filled with the spirit. Hello, somebody. But it's mandatory for me to be filled with the spirit and not drunk with the wine. Amen. I thank the Lord. I give God the praise, the glory, and the honor. God is good and He's good all the time. Amen. Well, oh, that one, let me back up there because I got up something else. Amen. Amen. Without you, know, I guess. Huh? You sure preach it good by talking about that money. See, you the clown. Amen. Amen. See, Paul said, if I give you, you ought to give to me. Yours is temporary. I tell you what, if you give me a dollar right now, as soon as I go to the store, it might be, I might not make it out of the office in there before it's gone. But if I give you a dollar, if I give you a blessing, right. hello somebody, Amen. that blessing will be with you forever. Amen. If they lay hands on you, if God tell you that ain't no weapon formed against you that shall prosper, that is a done deal. Uh, hello somebody. God bless, God bless Adam. And when they went, when, when it went down in the garden, of Eve, he cursed the ground for Adam's sake because Adam was blessed. God, oh, hello somebody. Salt water, fresh water don't come out the same fountain. Hello, somebody. Amen. When God bless you, you are blessed. Hello, somebody. Amen. I thank the Lord. Amen. Now, the table around you might be full of hell, but you blessed. I thank the Lord. Amen. Give God the praise, the glory, and the honor. Amen. And you have to stay on the blessing here. Amen. I, 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 huh? Hello, somebody. Amen. We thank the Lord, amen. We hope that some of y'all with us this afternoon, amen, but we're going to have a good time, amen. God's moving by the power of his might. He's moving by the spirit, amen. 
and, and, and hello somebody, amen. We turn the water into wine, amen. Everywhere we go, hello somebody, amen. And that gets, that gets the first miracle, hello somebody, amen. I thank the Lord, I give God the praise, the glory, and uh, cause the second miracle is just speaking the man back into life, y'all. I thank the Lord, amen. Give God the praise, the glory, and uh, Father, we just pray right now with the blessing on your people, Lord God. We just speak the blessing, Lord God, that the yoke that's been destroyed, Lord God, that your people may be able to take up their cross and follow you, that they may be able to come away from the thing that they already been delivered from, Lord God, and stop hanging around the corner. Uh, hello, somebody. Amen. Put them things out, Lord God. Oh, Father God, even though you don't stop using drugs, you can't hang on the drug corner. Amen. Even though you don't stop drinking, you can't hang in the box. Hello, somebody. Even though you don't stop being a hater, you can't hang around a hater. Even though you don't stop being a sinner, you got to make your hello, somebody. You got to come out from amongst them. Hello, somebody. God is calling us to come out from among them, amen. God is calling us, and you, you got, you got time. He said, he said, he said, tear it in Jerusalem. I want you to come out. I want you to start hanging out in Jerusalem until I give you power over, over, over them demons that you've been dealing with. I want you to come on in, and I want you to sit down. I want you to be still and see the salvation of God. I want, I want the power of God to rest on you, amen. But it's not your will, it's my will. It's not your way, it's my way. Hello, somebody. You might have a mind to do, but do you have a spirit that's able to do it? Hello, somebody. And the increase comes from God and not from you. And ain't nothing going to work until we do thank God. Wait, I don't care what you try to do. Hello, somebody. We are saved by faith, and that faith is in Jesus and not in the law. What we want to do our own thing. We want to do it like we want to do it. And have you got enough for doing your own? Come on, come on. Hello, somebody. I thank the Lord. Father, in the name of Jesus, we speak the blessing over your people that they may take up their bed and follow you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And amen.